Hello everyone, how are you doing today? I'm back with another video and in today's video we have an ASUS laptop. This one is an ASUS model number is an X541N version. And in this video, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you guys based on the request how to remove or how to replace your battery for this one as the battery is not uh, replaceable from the externally, so it's internally uh, put it in. So we're gonna, I'm gonna show you guys how to remove it very easy. All right, uh, first thing before we start, you need a couple of things. We need to make sure the laptop is powered off completely. So don't suspend or anything, just power it off completely. Grab yourself an opening tool and a screwdriver set. I use the iFixit tool set. I leave the link in the description. These are one of the screw, best screwdriver set I ever used. They have a S2 class steel. We're gonna be using a, a Phillips a number zero from this tool set. They include a pro version kit, that they include our opening tools and many other stuff. Check them out. All right, but for opening tool, I use the guitar pick, a metallic guitar pick, which is soft edges. It will not scratch and is really tough to bend. Once you flip the laptop over, you're gonna see a whole bunch of screws on the bottom cover. There are two sets of screws in here. There's a one shorter than the other one and that's it. Pretty much the shortest screws are located in the front end of the laptop. So there's one, two, three, four short screws on the front and the mid towards the back, these are the longest screws. So that's how you should remember. Do not place the longest screws in the front end, otherwise it's just gonna poke and push the, create a little bump on the uh, palm rest. You're not gonna damage the motherboard or anything, but you're just gonna have a little dent on the other side. So make sure you put the longest screws from the mid towards the back. And also I see only a few of my viewers subscribe to my channel. And if you guys like my content, uh, if you find it useful and helpful, please click that like button and think about subscribing. It really helps and motivates me to make more videos for you guys and take requests from you guys. I really appreciate it. So let's go ahead and remove. I keep the screws a little separate. so. That way I don't have to actually... But the, the difference is about like a one or two millimeters the difference. So it's really hard to make a mistake. That's why I keep them apart. Well, once you remove the screws, you want to grab yourself the guitar pick or the opening tool that you have. And you want to open up the laptop in 45 degree angle. You want to stick the guitar pick right between the bottom and the top cover. And you want to stick it right there about two millimeter and you just want to wiggle it around. You want to hear that click so that the clips are getting loose. You're not breaking anything. You're just loosening up the clips. Work yourself around to the side, all the way to the back corner. Make sure you put your hand underneath so the palm rest don't fall down. All right, now you see the palm rest is loose enough. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna put it in a regular position and I'm gonna lift it up. Don't lift up too much because you don't wanna yank the flex cable down here. And what we wanna do, we want to open up the screen a little more. We want to untangle the back. So once you have the back there, so I put my palm here so I don't pull it out. So I just lift up the back a little bit. Now I'm going to lift up tiny about one centimeter and move it towards the left side, just like that, where the speaker matches. Now I can actually open it up a little bit more and I can remove this flex cable right here. To remove it, you want to lift up, let me see if you guys can see it. This black cover, put your finger under this black cover and lift it up 90 degrees, just like that. And then you can slide out the flex cable for the screen. Same thing for this touchpad. Put your finger underneath, lift it up 90 degrees and slide out the touchpad. If you do this here, you're not gonna be able to do it and you might damage your flex cable. All right. Now you can see it is very dirty too. The battery is one, two, three cell batteries here. So to remove the battery is unscrew this one over here. One is screw right in the middle. And one is screw right by, there's a star shape sign right there. Once you have these two screws loosened up, also go ahead and loosen up this screw in the corner by the hinges, it's a chrome screw. Now, you want to grab a screwdriver or a flat something like a spatula, something like that. 
So there's another adhesive right to the this one here. You want to lift it up to rip that adhesive on the bottom. So I'm just lifting up a little bit. Once it's loosened up, just lift it up and grab it. Don't let it go down. So I'm keeping it and I'm just gonna pretty much twist it. Just twist a little bit. So I'm scooping these contacts underneath and I'm pulling it towards the screen and there we go. That's your battery. If you want to replace it, the model number for this battery, it is right over here. It's a pretty long number. It's an A31 N1601. These are the 18650B models. So you can get them or replace the cells on this one if you want to. It's pretty much open source, let's call it. There's no cover. The electronic is right here. Once you get the new battery in, all you need to do is the same thing, bring it right over here. Lift up a little bit so you want to scoop it right, this contact right there. And you want to scoop it right under the motherboard. Lift up with your finger a little bit the motherboard and then squeeze it right there and place it down there. Now you're going to put the two screws, one right over here. And the other one right over here. And the hinge is screw that holds the hinge on the motherboard both together. Make sure you tighten up this one nicely. All right, once you have this one in, now the trick to put the palm rest. You want to put the palm rest in the offset position, same position that you removed with the speaker aligned with the border right here. And what you want to do, you make sure the lock is open for this one. And then grab the flex and slide it right underneath make sure it's evenly aligned right there and then once it's aligned in there close the lid just push it back forward same thing with the touchpad slide it right underneath and close the lid now you want to open up the laptop a little bit and you don't want to lift it up too much you just about one or two centimeter and just bring it over shift it over to the normal position now you want to pinch the front end really hard you want to hear those clicks all right now press the side make sure you hear those clicks press the hinge side and the back all right once you have the cover in place you want to flip it over and the last thing would be to put in the bottom screws Remember again, the short screw goes in front of the laptop. So press the short, place the short screws in front and the long one from the mid toward the back. Again, I hope you guys like this video and helped you guys out to upgrade your uh, battery. If it did, please think about subscribing and clicking that like button. And again, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you guys in my next video. Just gonna finish putting up these screws. All right, and that's how you upgrade your battery or re replace your battery for your ASUS laptop.